SCP-1370, aka Pestabot. Object class, safe. Special containment procedures. SCP-1370 is locked in a fireproof glass display case, stored in, in Gallery 27. If the case becomes damaged by external circumstance, any container with the dimensions of at least 1.25 times 0 0.75 times times 0 0.50 meters will suffice as a replacement until a new new display case is available. The ethics committee he recommend is that any long-term storage case contain in enough space for SCP-1370 will to move freely. Level 2 personnel and higher may, may remove SCP-1370 from its case is at their discretion, but will we'll face disciplinary action for failing to secure it properly. Description SCP-1370 is a self-aware artificial being being constructed from, from various electrical devices and tools. It stands appro approximately one meter in height, and is capable of moving between its articulated joints despite the lack of any power source or mo motors. SCP-1370 communicates in a monotone voice via speaker mounted in, in its chest. Its head is a is a bold meter. It's so ordered upside down onto to a neck joint, like giving the appearance of a friendly smile, but containing no active sen sensory devices. However, SCP-1370 will react to visual and audible stimuli and and its ability to to do so is hampered with when the head is covered or or otherwise restrained. Its design appears to to give more importance to an, to aesthetic concern rather than function, as evidenced by by a pure center or center of gravity. That that have that hampers its ability to balance and walk. It is therefore believed that SCP-1370 was created as an art, art, art object and then later imbued with anomalous properties, rather than designed with those in mind. It can currently speak, speak fluent American, English, French, and Latin, and is capable of learning new languages. Other facets of its intellectual capacity have not been clearly outlined as SCP-1370 the 1370 is is invariably hostile in all interactions with that with any being, being or object that it interprets to be sapient. This includes, but not not as limit, not to animals, foundation personnel, civilians, audiovisual equipment, and security cameras. If SCP-1370 Encounters an object it believes to be sapient, it will attempt to engage in the, the object in, the, in combat while introducing itself with a variety of elaborate titles which appear to be selected at random. Examples include Do Doombot 2000, Robo Lord the Destructor, Prime Minister Sinister, and Death Hog Killflex. SCP 1370 will often Include variation of these titles based on responses it receives from, from personnel. Foundation staff have successfully introduced Pathia and Con Bergamos and Pesterbot to his lexicon. End of. Many tests on SCP 1370 combat prowess have been run, run each covering that. It that SCP-1370 
lacks the physical amplitude to cause damage to any living being. Tests 1370-829 exposed to Exposed SCP-1370 to a, a common house plants with with a speaker hidden in the plant's pot. After SCP-1370 was provoked verbally, it attempted to fall, fold and twist the leaves using the plant within its grasp as before the cat incapacitating itself. See, see log that thought follows. Richard L. Allen's and T. He bought some, some carry, the SCP three one three seven zeros. Those case into, in the testing chamber. The case is set, set down one meter here from a pot. I have a dendron, and fitted it with a small, small speaker. Release me and sex. I am Doom Master thirteen. In seventy, the master of all doom, I shall be the herald of your destruction. Researchers leave, leave the testing and chamber, and in the case is open and remotely. Although no security risk is determined, the test has requires SCP-1370 or to focus on the plant rather than the nearby personnel. Observations were made via op. He glass window to prevent prevent SCP one one three seven zero from attacking its own reflection. At last, I am unleashed upon upon this world, oh, so deserving of destruction. All shall be rent, and within my pinchers, there's all shall be a trample being me five feet. I am Shivatron, this boiler of murk. Through the speaker mountain in, in the plant. Hello? Can you hear me? Approaching the plant. Who dares? All souls will burn. You will feel the sharp our sting of my wrath. Identify yourself so I I may si sing damn She upon you as you die. I must split it leaf filled hindrance. A semi wooden woody shrub with with large glossy leaves, restrained laugh laughter, these leaves can grow up to three feet long. Attempts to wrestle with the leaves. Mockery, your mockery spells your doom. I, I have arrived. You will be crushed be, betwixt, makes my digits. SCP one, one three seven zero falls over, but is unable to, hold to right itself. After approximately six minutes, it it knocks over, knocks the pot over, for which rolls to to a position that pins pins SCP P one three seven zero body into the floor floor of the chamber. Researchers enter the enter to 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 return SCP one three seven zero. Go to its case.